Welcome to 14 Creekway Court. This lovely three bedroom, two and a half bath home with a covered front porch, one car garage, screened back porch as well as deck, and hardwood flooring inside. Sits on a cul de sac in the East Lake subdivision in Southeast Columbia. Convenient to I 77. Fort Jackson, the VA Hospital, and USC Med School. We're out in the front yard. You see there's the one car garage or entrance to it on the right side here. You have a nice archway leading towards the back side of the house, which has some plantings over it. And then a covered front porch here as well. As you enter, a couple steps up onto the porch. And then once we get Inside, you'll notice the hardwood flooring throughout the foyer, entry hall, and living room. On this side, continues up the stairs into the hall as well. You have some other types of flooring in other areas. But you have a nice entry here off the front door. You have some updated lighting in here as well. The living and dining space is to the left as you come off of the entry. You have some crown molding in here. A nice fireplace on the left as well. And some beadboard wainscoting and chair rail molding in here. It's got some, you have some decorative detailing to sort of separate the living room from the dining area a bit. You have a big window looking out over the back deck. And then you step through into the kitchen. So you can see some updated lighting fixtures here in the kitchen. You have white cabinets, wood countertops, and stainless steel appliances. There is a built-in microwave, smooth top electric range, as well as a side-by-side -side refrigerator on this side. And then you have the dishwasher over here in white, nice window over the kitchen sink and that looks out over the screen porch and out over the backyard. And you even have some nice details like sort of a built-in rack for wine glasses there. The good storage in the kitchen, this would normally be sort of an eat-in dining area, but you do have the fridge in this space as it's laid out right now. But it does give you a bit of extra room on this side sort of looking back towards the door or towards the entry hall and then off the back here you have the screen porch so nice size it sort of runs along the left of the kitchen and dining um, area on the back side here and then as you can see it overlooks the backyard it sort of slopes down pretty steeply but it does back up to a sort of wooded buffer area back here and then you also have a wood deck off to the side, so sort of multi-level outdoor space. And then a nice area down there as you can see in the backyard, sort of marked out with some pebbles as well. And then back inside, just going through the kitchen again, have a few doors off of the hall here. So one is the half bathroom downstairs, you have tile floor in here, and they've done sort of a tile wall and backsplash for going along there. Single vanity. And then you have this built in cabinet along the back, which still gives you some extra storage, which is pretty nice. And then across the hall from that, just some cabinets, excuse me, some closet space on this side, a coat closet. And then you have access over here to the one car garage. As you can see, it's a pretty decent size as well. There's a vehicle parked in right now just for some scale. And you can see there's built-in shelving, some along that wall and as you enter as well. And a workbench and some more storage back here also. You can see there's a tankless water heater in here. But going back through, We'll go up to the second level. Some real hardwood treads on the stairs. Here as you go up. And that in 
engineered wood flooring on the second level landing as well. The so master bedroom is off to this side. You have vaulted ceilings in here. I apologize for that bright light. And a ceiling fan, windows looking out towards the front of the property. And then you have on this end your walk-in closet, which has some extra built-ins, which is nice. And the full bathroom, you have a garden tub and shower, as well as double sinks on this wall. And then you have some updated lighting in here as well. And then back behind in the alcove here you have the commode and a shelf. You have some chair rail molding in, in here as well. Attic pull down in the hallway. Second full bathroom right next door. You have a single vanity, sort of a medicine cabinet hutch against the wall and shower and tub there. And then bedroom number two. Also with the ceiling fan and the closets on the opposite side here in the corner. Third bedroom, this one faces the front, that last one faced the backyard. Pretty decent size closet here in the corner as you can see again. And then last but not least, you have the laundry room, which is a really nice size. You have some also have some built-in areas in here as well, some shelving built in, as well as some extra cabinetry for storage and a shelf above the area for a full-size washer and dryer. So very nice laundry room to finish off the second floor. And that also completes the tour of this home, 14 Creek Way Court in Southeast Columbia. You can find more information online at turnerproperties.com.